Hey everyone, uh, welcome back to Longland on uh, Transport Fever 2. Right, so last time around we did some faffing about uh, over here in Central City. We got uh, Raccoon City operating. Um, now, the next stop is going to be Emerald City where we've put the initial uh, train station platforms, right? But now I need to get the uh, tracks into there. Now, uh, you might think we should just come in here and just bounce in this way. Now, that's not going to work particularly well. And the reason is the next stop on this line is going to be Hill Valley. And that's over here. So we don't want to be going this way. We need to be coming down this way from the top left to the bottom right. So that means that we need to come out of here, uh, we need to get over the, the river, and we need to come in, and then we need to come in from around here and down through here. Now, we can't really combine it with the freight line here. Uh, it's just not going to work. There's too much traffic on there. And that means that uh, we'll need to uh, get this here uh, set up so the... Uh, uh, the track can get out. Now, uh, I want to uh, avoid uh, issues with the uh, uh, other tracks here, so I don't want any level crossings. And there's no way we can crank it around sharp and then go out this way. There's too much stuff in the way, and that would end up creating a level crossing here. And to make things worse, we have an uphill gradient here. Um, coming up this way. Uh, I believe we have, and yeah, we do. Uh, so I've been pondering for like 10 seconds, and I came to a, uh, a conclusion. Uh, that conclusion is that this crossroad probably needs to go away. And I want to see, and po probably this one too, and then I think the uh, question is, how far do we have to go out here to get underground? So, if we take this out, right, um, and then we, uh, wait a minute, sound's not doing the right thing here. Um... Right. No, it's not. Um, I'll be uh, I'll be back in a bit when I sort that out. Okay, I think I've got it sorted out now. Um, yeah. Uh, right. Okay. So I was uh, going to find out. Uh, how much, yeah, we do want uh, catenary whatever. Um, I wanted to find out how much I needed to, to do to go get underground if I come out this way. Um, uh, okay, so we can get underground if we go that far steep. Okay, well that is an option that will work. Okay, uh, that's definitely going to be better than the uh, alternative, uh, which was going up and over all of under here and all around this way. So, uh, yeah, we can uh, crank it around, uh, probably level here. Uh, we can crank it around up here. Uh, yeah, yeah, we'll go about that fast there, right? Now we need to come around. We need to get past this track here, so we need to come around to about here. Yeah, I think that'll uh, that'll work. Okay. That gets us past all the tracks that are in the way. Okay. 
Right. Then we need to get... Um, yeah, we need to get over... Okay, now we need to come up. Uh, no, I need to go past the uh, industry there as well. Uh, because there's uh, too much traffic on the other side of the... Um, uh, river there as well. Too much uh, rail uh, complication there. Okay, so if we do this, yeah, we can get under all of that. Good. Uh, okay, now we can come up and uh, out of the... Um, how is that level related to the river? Well, we want to go over this track so that's probably acceptable at least if we come at it on that angle yeah okay right um yeah yeah okay that'll work good um okay bring the other track up here right now, we need to get a uh, level-ish bridge here. Now, that one is acceptable. Um, that one may be... Hmm. Maybe not. Um, that one? What about that one? No. No. What about this one? Yeah, I think we'll go with that one. Yeah. Well, it's 180, though. Um, do you think 180 is going to be too slow? Not really. Okay, we'll go for it then. Uh, right. Okay. Good. Well, that gives us a... Uh, track coming across the river yep okay so now we have the problem of getting out of raccoon city um yeah okay well we're gonna want to probably come around the back of the uh, industry here and then head to oh yeah that should be easy enough uh although this is gonna be in the way yeah that's definitely gonna be in the way even that's going to be in the way. Um, okay. So, build the track then. Uh, yeah, we'll come out of here level. Okay. Now, uh, it seems to me that maybe uh, doing some uh, road works here might not be a terrible idea. Uh, say, perhaps we do this to get a uh, road coming out there and then we can possibly get a road a across here hmm nope uh, we could do that yeah eh meh no. 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 We need to come out of here flat. Um, okay. Pause it. Uh, okay. So we come around here flat. Yeah. Okay. And then this can come out to here. Right. Then we can do a uh, crossing like this yeah and that can come all the way out to well that's amusing uh, all the way out to here right and this one can come out to here right yeah what if we get rid of this and that Okay, well that gets us a uh, rail crossing at least, 
Now it's a level crossing, but I don't think that's a problem. Right. Now, uh, we need to run our track. You know, level through there is probably fine. Or level-ish. Okay. Then we can come around. Yeah, I think we kind of want to face about that direction. Right. Good. Now, uh, we can come in here and build a whacking great uh, sweeping curve. Right. Okay. I think that should be an embankment. Yeah. Okay. Well, that certainly gives a uh, credible um, uh, track. Now, uh, were we running? A oh, yeah, we have a line into there. Okay. Now, this um, platform here is uh, too short. Uh, it's not, I'm not going to make it. Uh, particularly longer I don't think but it does mean that if we want to do a turning service here we're gonna to have to put the uh, the the um, switch in the uh, tunnel I don't want to do that so uh, instead let's see about uh, moving this uh, out Uh, some distance here, yeah, some distance here that's not a ridiculous distance, yeah, that's still a ridiculous distance. Now, if we come out here level, okay, I think that will probably work, so if we do that, and we do the trick to get sort of reasonable uh, crossings, right? Yeah, okay, good. And then we bring this out here. Okay, that gets us a uh, train, uh, train line that can come through there. Now we're heading for Hill Valley, which means we need to go back across the, uh, the river and then we can come in and parallel this. Uh, yeah, because we might as well put the uh, passenger platforms on this station here. Okay. Well, um, yeah, let's, uh, let's get that uh, operating. Okay. Right. So if we come out here... Um, okay, so we kind of want to come on about that. We might as well go straight. Yeah, let's see where we end up with if we're level. Uh, where's straight? There's straight. Uh, how do I know it's straight? Because it snapped. That is a pretty high uh, bridge pier. That might be fine. Um, okay, well, how horrid is it if we do this? Well, it's not too terrible. We just need to stop it there. Okay. Um, okay, now we can come out here and come across the uh, river. Level. Yeah? Yeah. Okay. Um, now, do we have a... That one? No. What about that one? No. That one? No, that looks ridiculous. Um... Okay, that one's slow. Well, 
that one that one has that one has uh, some sort of uh, structure to it. Yeah, let's go with that one. Okay. Uh, now, just need to bring the other track out here. It's so uh, so much easier doing all of this when you have all the money, right? Uh, now, we want to come down to uh, even with this track. Okay, and that's going to come down about there. Okay, so we're going to need a parallel track here. Um, now we come up to here. That is going to be an embankment. Well, at least for most, for part of it. Okay, well, we'll do that. Then we do this. And then, what do we have? More bridge. Yeah. Okay, and then we can cut this comes in here. Okay. Well, that should work. Um, now, need to build the uh, passenger station here. Yeah. Um, well, this is going to have to go for sure. Uh, okay, well, we'll pause it while I do this as well. Because um, this has to go to. Yep. Uh, we're going to need uh, platforms. Uh, we're going to need some nice uh, passenger platforms uh, with some tracks in it. Yeah. Right. Okay, that works. Now, platforms. Put more of those in. Uh, right. And I'm going to put one of these here. And uh, I'm going to also put a cargo platform over here because why not yeah um okay now we're gonna put a uh, cargo thing over here yep and we're gonna put a large passenger operation over here uh yep we're going to put a... No, those are cargo buildings. Uh, we're going to put a large passenger operation over here. Yeah. And then we're going to put a small passenger operation over here. Yeah. Okay. Now we need uh, some of this fancy stuff here, uh, which we'll do like this. Yep. And we'll do this. And this. Yep. Okay. Uh, now, if we duck out of here and we. Yeah, so we got decent uh, coverage there. Uh, okay, now. Uh, we uh, get rid of this. Yep. Good. Need to do a little bit of road operations here. So we'll have that. And this. Yep. And then this. Yep. This can go up to here. Yep. It can go exactly like that. Okay. Um... Yeah, so that should uh, that should actually operate. So now we can get the uh, clock rolling again, right? Uh, there's some rail we need to plumb in here. Um, okay, we need it to come up about here, I think. So if we do this, yeah, that works. Okay, 
Good. And we just need to uh, connect that. Good. Now, uh, to extend the passenger line here, I'm going to need to do this. Nope. I'm going to need to do this. Yep. And then we need to chuck a signal or three on here. So we'll need a signal here. Right. And here seems like a good spot. So does here. And a couple points along here will definitely want some signaling. Um, yep. Now this, um, just driving a track straight through things like this is actually fairly uh, uh, reasonable uh, operation. I'll put the signals back this far because the train's going to overhang the platform. Uh, right. Uh, this is uh, probably not such an unreasonable uh, layout for uh, a uh, what's basically a high-speed rail line. Uh, okay. Um, even a real-world uh, situation, it's probably not so uh, so terrible now. Uh, if we go in here and we grab our uh, uh, Gotham City main, um, right, so we're going to manage the line and we're going to go from Raccoon City, uh, we're going to add a uh, station here, and then we're going to go down to here, add that, and then add this going back, and then Raccoon City going back. Yeah? Yeah. Okay. Now, we're going to manage the vehicles. Now, I think I want to put... Uh, we added... Yeah, I think I want to put... I'm just going to double them because we're going to have... Uh, this is going to be longer yet. So, I'm going to double the uh, stuff. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to jump on board here. Uh, at uh, Raccoon City and we're going to uh, ride the new bit of rail uh, and this new bit of rail it shouldn't have an issue but you know I want to see what it looks like heading into um, uh, the whatchamacallit uh, place um, Emerald City yeah uh, yeah it's uh, well that uh, rail that level crossing there came out okay. That is perfectly flat. Yeah. Okay. That's definitely good. Now, we just see how long it takes to get up to a decent speed and just tick along the uh, track here. You know, see how bad the tunnel is as well. See if it was it's too close to the surface. Uh, it's possible if the like sometimes it'll let you build a tunnel that's uh, shallow enough that things on the surface impinge into the tunnel from above. I mean that's not unrealistic, uh, but you know that a shallow tunnel would run into stuff from the surface. But uh, there's some uh, manky collision uh, uh, detection operation stuff uh, with tunnels. And you get some interesting results sometimes. Uh, you, you can be, uh, you know, you can even see the bottom of tracks uh, impinging from above sometimes. Um, yeah. Uh, I, I just want to make sure that we don't have something that manky going on there. Because uh, it did look really shallow where it uh, surfaced uh, when I was building it. Um, right, okay, well... We're ticking along at a hundred kilometers an hour. Um, I could, you know, speed this up. But I don't think there's any particular uh, need to speed this up. Right, this is the 180 kilometer an hour bridge. Uh, as you can see, we're peaking at a hundred kilometers an hour, so it doesn't need to be any faster. Uh, you know, and that's what I was thinking when I when I went with it. Also, it has the uh, the 
girder operation there, the, 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 the wall thing, right? Okay, and there's the uh, Whacking Great Viaduct that uh, I put in so long ago now. Actually, it doesn't look half bad with the uh, steam trains going by up top. Uh, and we're coming up on our tunnel here. Uh, the entrance looks okay. Yeah, it looks okay in here. So uh, this could have been uh, could have been worse. Uh, yeah. Now we're going to start slowing down as we bend around into Emerald uh, City. Yeah. Now, I, normally you don't want uh, corners like that in your um, rail uh, network, but that is uh, that's actually acceptable because it's coming into the station that way. Now let's see this particular train. Um. That could be worse by a long margin. Okay. Well, let's get back in here. These crossings are not terrible. Uh, so that's definitely acceptable. Well, I say it's not terrible. That is pretty manky, isn't it? Uh, maybe I'll come back and do a little bit of detailing on the town later. Uh, and that one's solvable. You just bring the road up to track height beside the track there and uh, rebuild the crossing. Uh, let the uh, slope happen further away from the uh, rail. Now we come out of here. This is where we come out level. I'm going to crank up the uh, tempo a bit here. And here we come across the bridge. Ooh, trippy. Uh, right. Okay. And I'll bring it back down to something. See, I did that just so that we could get here a little faster. I mean, this train ride's going to be the end of the episode, but... Uh, yeah, here's a... Uh, now, here we have uh, low-speed tracks with steam trains to the right, and uh, high-speed tracks with electric trains on the left here. That'd be a good spot to build a uh, crossover between the two sets of uh, tracks uh, in the future, possibly. And then we bend off here at a uh, more gentle angle than the uh, other one does. Right. Okay, now we're coming into our uh, station here. And, okay, well, this, uh, this looks okay to me. Uh, oh, we've got development over there already, uh, so that's good. And we're picking up uh, passengers here, so, so that's, uh, that's definitely good. There's uh, passengers waiting. Uh, okay, so we unload a bunch, and then we load up. Now, we're taking a full load back, uh, but some of those passengers were going back from uh, uh, Raccoon City uh, and hadn't uh, updated, right? Uh, so, there's that. And we'll, we'll have another train along shortly there. Okay, well, that's, um, that's working. Uh, so, I think, uh, I think we can reasonably say that... Uh, things are sorted. Uh, probably want a uh, rail, uh, like a, a crossing over here somewhere. Uh, but uh, yeah, that's something for later on if I come back to it. Anyway, that is uh, that. The next step is to bring the high-speed passenger service in through Hawkins and Nowhere. 
I'm not sure how I'm going to handle this one actually. Uh, so I'll have to think about that. And then from there, it'll go on to, uh, it'll go on to uh, the uh, Avalon uh, Camelot complex here. Yeah. Okay, so uh, so that's going to be all for this time. Uh, next time, uh, extending this uh, bottom main line here uh, over this way, and that should be uh, vaguely entertaining. Anyway, uh, you know, there's the whole like, comment, and subscribe thing. Yeah, uh, you can do that um, or not, as you see fit, or you can hit dislike even. Uh, I'm pretty sure that's still a thing you can do, even if it doesn't show counts. And yeah, the uh, bell thing. If you turn it on, uh, you might get some notifications that you may or may not find useful. You know, it's entirely up to you and all. Uh, anyway, uh, see you back next time, I guess.